Let's talk about yeah. the traffic and the weather. Let's start with the weather, of course. Big changes. It's all because of this front. Boy, look at the huge cool down that we've had. Temperatures in the 50s have now dropped down into the 20s. Big changes. And look at the teens and uh, single digits below zero now. That's the cold air that's been trying to move in. Uh, otherwise, though, it's quiet once that cold air moves in. So that's some good news. At least we can get this icy system out of here. Once that happens, uh, we'll see things dry out. Although a little bit of the snow could lift to the north before the whole system finally slides to the east. Just look how dry the air mass is back to the west. That's what's moving in. Although a little bit of lake effect snow could be possible today and tonight, maybe early tomorrow. But uh, again, it's all because of that north wind. You'll see it in future casts. You'll see this north wind stay with us. Most of this system will exit, but then you'll start to see some streamers along the lake that may lead to some snow in northwestern Indiana or even into uh, the city here where we could pick up maybe a dusting or some light accumulation. I don't think it's going to be that big of a deal, although even through early morning we may still have some lake effect snow ongoing, but temperatures starting out pretty chilly. So as far as our forecast through the weekend today, 24, we stay near 20 for a couple of days here. A few flurries even possible Saturday morning will increase the clouds after some sunshine early Sunday. Day. We'll keep the temperatures cold near 20. Uh, thankfully, it's mostly a dry forecast, but that was not the case early this morning where a little bit of uh, caution is needed.